Well, hi, my name's Mark. I'm a head instructor here at the Australian Martial Arts Academy. I started martial arts as a 20 year old in the adults program. Um, for me, starting martial arts, it was uh, quite an intimidating experience. I walked in and I wasn't sure what to expect. I had this preconceived notion that martial arts was this you know, tough industry and that everyone you'd encounter was a black belt and then smashing roof tiles and backflips. And I walked in and I was greeted by the most welcoming people. Uh, at the Australian Martial Arts Academy and they just made me feel uh, straight away part of the family. I grew up in North Queensland which uh, is a far cry from the in the suburbs of Sydney and uh, and so I actually came down to Sydney uh, straight out of high school so as soon as I graduated year 12 um, I'd always had um, a quite successful run through school, um, came down and I was ad uh, admitted into the University of New South Wales to study medicine on a scholarship, um, so I was feeling really, really uh, confident and it was a great experience. I always wanted to do medicine because I, I just had this passion for wanting to help people change their lives and, and feel good about themselves. So for me, Coming down to Sydney, there was a lot of new things to learn. I'd never caught a bus or a train before. I had to overcome those barriers. And I really settled well into, into all of my studies. Um, I took some of my other sporting interests, athletics, to a whole new level. Um, started going faster and going, making a, into the Australian qualifiers for those. Um, and pushing myself always to do a little bit more and go a little bit faster. Each day I, would, I, was, I was studying, I was working hard and I found that things were just starting to get a little bit harder for me and over the course of a year things just kept continuing, it was getting harder and harder and then one day I found that I just wasn't able to, to get up, it was really hard and, and I went and got all these health investigations done and it turned out that I had chronic fatigue syndrome. Now this is something that um, was a massive blow to me. I'd always found it, you know, quite easy to accomplish the goals I'd set. And now I had this massive challenge that I was told, sorry, there is no treatment. You got to try and just manage it the best you can. When I first walked through the doors here at the Australian Martial Arts Academy, I came in and I straight away was welcomed by Miss Sarah, as most people who walk through the doors are, with a great smile and told, welcome, how may I help you? And the great thing here was Miss Sarah was expecting me. I'd called up just before I came in and spoken to the master and he had invited me to come in um, and straight away get started in the program no matter what obstacles were in the way. He said, we'll look after you, we'll help you in. Through the discipline of martial arts, I've been able to take back control of my own health and my own journey in life. And as such, I now want to positively enable other people to take better control of their lives and achieve what they want to achieve.